Apple by the UK's leading mobile phone comparison website has revealed that almost a fifth of handset owners have intentionally broken their mobile in the past and basically to claim on their insurance policy. Two thirds apparently are making a false claim. Andy Barr is the marketing director from rightmobilephone.co.uk. Andy, good morning. Good morning, how are you? I'm good. Good to talk to you again, Andy. How are you? Not too bad, not too bad. It's a bit grey and drizzly here, so I'm hoping for a bit of sun. <laughs> well, I heard your weather over there over the last week has been absolutely extraordinary. Oh, it's, it's really scorchy. There's a bit of burnt grass. It's really exciting. Well, I mean, we've got, we've got a bit of greyness here that's going to happen in rain, as apparently for the rest of the week over the, this country. Um, but not till the weekend. It'll pick up again. That's what we've been assured. Hopefully. Mobile phones, what's going on? Well, it, it's scary, and, and let's just start, you know, from from the very outset saying we at Right Mobile Phone think this is wrong, people shouldn't do it, but some cheeky scamps out there are thinking, actually, my phone, it's not as up-to-date as I want it to be, so I'm going to accidentally reverse over it, I'm going to accidentally drop it down the toilet, and the insurance company are going to give me some money, and I'm going to go out and buy a new one. So it's totally wrong, but it turns out quite a lot of us are doing it. And it's it's all just to, for the money, isn't it? Well, I think it's people get phone envy, so they're seeing that they've maybe got an old BlackBerry and they want the new iPhone, and they're thinking, well, how can I, how can I speed up the process mm. of getting one? What they don't realise is a lot of the insurance companies only give like for like, so if you're doing it because you want the latest phone, it's not going to work, so you've just got to stick where you are, either buy yourself out of the contract, as, uh, as we recommend on Right Mobile Phone, or just, just wait, and, uh, wait until you can get an upgrade. OK, so, I mean, you know, morally, this is wrong. You shouldn't be doing it. Oh, very very much so. I think the only winners in this, and this is where we were quite surprised, is in some way the insurance companies, because we found out quite a staggering 71% of people with a contract mobile phone actually do have insurance now, which is really good because the amount of people who've maybe dropped it when they've been on a cheeky night out or they've lost it down the back of the couch and not seen it for months. So there is some good news in there. OK, so, I mean, there, there are some genuine cases. Uh, do people, would they, I mean, they obviously they would have to take out a policy on their phone to insure it in order to be able to claim back. Very much so. And I think, again, um, with the likes of us at Right Mobile, right mobile Phone, when you go in and buy the uh, phone, you can also get the insurance while you're there online. So it's a really simple, easy thing to do. But it, the, the fact that uh, 20, I think it was nearly 20% of people said that they would do this it's quite a high figure. Mm. But then when you think that 60% of people have actually said they think about it, that's an even more startling figure. Do you know, it never even dawned on me. <laughs> it's not something I'd actually even think about doing because I'm, you know, quite happy with the phone I have. I've had it quite a... It's not a, a new phone by any means. I've, I've had it for quite a long time. And if anything, I did get a new or one that I lost and had to have blocked then and went back to the old one, found the one that I lost and, and still using the old one um, because I just find I'm happy enough to make phone calls, receive them and do the text messages. I, you know, I have a great camera if I need to take pictures but um, I do have a more, I do have a fairly high grade one but I like my old phone. It makes life easy I think for me. you and I are in the same boat. You know, we, we've got phones that are practical and they're what we need and one of the things that we have on the site, you can go and choose what features you want and then you can get the phone that best fits what you require. So, you know, for me, I just want to be able to make a few calls, That's maybe it. check an email every now and again and yeah, maybe take a picture of me little one when uh, when I can. You know, I don't want all the sort of maybe newfangled things. But mm. I think I'll throw something controversial out there. I'd suggest that it's maybe the younger generation that are getting caught up in this insurance kind of uh, breaking your phone to try and get the new one because they want the latest phones. And do you think we've kind of lost the run of ourselves when it comes to this technology? Because, I mean, if we could change the remote control, if we could change the TV stations and use the phone as a, mo a remote control, we'd be doing that. Oh, well, I've got a great app on my phone where I can, uh, I can set my Sky Plus so, from my phone. So if I'm out and think, crikey, you know, I've really missed that uh, Country File Weekly, the, the gripping one about sheeps and badgers, then <laughs> I, can, I can just hit that button on my iPhone and, and I'm away, I'm recording it, and I could be anywhere in the world. Oh, I don't know. I, you know, I think if I, if I really want something, I'll, I'll find a way of getting it without having to go through the phone lines. Exactly. What happened to just ringing your mum and saying, Mum, I forgot Will something? You press could you record, record it for me? Yeah. yeah, match of the day, Saturday night. Yeah. We've all been there. Press record, please, until I see it later instead of all this. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Andy, good to talk to you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Good morning, Andy Barr, the marketing director from right, rightmobilephone.co.uk.